In this tutorial, we want to demonstrate how to be able to copy paste text and images a little bit more simple than maybe what you're already currently doing it. Some of these tricks will save you time, be more efficient as you're trying to get lesson plans ready. The first trick that I want to demonstrate is called the triple click method. So just to let you know, anytime you put your cursor there and left click once, that actually places the cursor there. It tells the computer cursors at that area. If I double click it, I can actually copy a single word. If I triple click it, it copies the entire paragraph or at least highlights the entire paragraph. So double click, triple click. Okay, now once I've got it triple clicked, I could right click on it and I could hit copy. And then I can go to any document that I'm currently working on, like a Google Doc. I can right click and copy it and then paste that information right there by right clicking and pasting in any document that I'm at. The next trick is the highlight all text on a single page actually highlight everything on the page which is to hit your control key and control A and that will highlight every single thing that you can see so you can copy the whole page I method because it copies ads, it copies banners, pictures whatever it wants to copy, whatever's on that page it'll um, hide the whole thing and then of course obviously once it's selected you can actually right click and say copy and then go back to your document right click and say paste okay the next method the next thing I want to show you is a simple way to actually copy a lot of times people right click and copy but I'm a big fan of actually using my control C so if I control C and then go to the other document I can actually hit control V and it will paste it into my document and I won't have to right click and copy so that's a shortcut for those who love to use their keyboards instead of the mouse one of the tricks I tell my clients and the teachers that I work with is to remember that anytime you right click it actually gives you options okay so left clicking performs an action right clicking gives you options so if I right click on say this image here then it gives me options what I can do with it I can copy the image I can save the image or I can copy the image address the cool thing about that is that you can actually copy your image and then I can go right click copy my image and then come down in here and say right click paste and that's one way to get pictures in to your document as well most of you probably have done that a billion times okay another way to simplify your copy and paste ability speed things up is called the uh, drag and drop method to do the drag and drop method you would want to have two different windows open these are actually called windows okay and I'm going to use this resize tool or restore down is what it's really called tool and I'm going to click on that and what that does that allows me to resize this window to however wide I want it okay and then I go to another window hit the restore down button and I can resize it and the advantage of this is that I don't have to bounce around between different tabs I can keep both windows open and so now watch how quick I can actually copy a single word by double clicking on it and I just drag it right over okay I can triple click and copy an entire paragraph and drag it over and so you can actually come through and even take sections of text and drag it over without having to right clicking or control pasting saves me a lot of time or have you ever tried to highlight 
and you come down here and all of a sudden whoops and it grabs the whole page and you're like dang that's not as much as I want and you go back up and you're just going back and forth trying to get what you want okay well the triple click method really helps that but that only does one paragraph what if I want two paragraphs um, so another way is using the shift key let's say I want from if to yet one way to people do is they just left click and drag but do you see how it moves around as I'm trying to do that especially people with shaky hands so I'm going to click here and I could drag it over and that's fine but one way to do it is to actually left click where you want your cursor and then hold your shift key down and let's say I want to go to this word pan and I just left click here and it will actually get just that part of the paragraph or let's say I want this paragraph and I want all the way down to recipes okay I can actually hold my shift key down and grab that section of text as well and I can drag it over very 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 quickly okay with a little practice using these methods you will improve your ability to gather and place information into your documents um, and all reality I can't imagine not knowing these tricks I get things done much much quicker again triple click method the highlight method the shift method just depending on what I'm trying to do really saves me time and I love having two windows side by side because that saves me time as well if you find that this video is informative and helps you out please consider sharing it with your friends also to let you know we do have a website called educationalresource.org in which teachers can explore multiple resources that were either created by us or resources that we found that are worth using in your classroom it's very searchable you can actually come down here and explore by subject once you're inside that subject you can actually filter it via grade level you can filter it by the type of math concept you're looking for science concept and it will continue to trim down until you find exactly what you're looking for or you can just use our search which does a pretty good job searching the entire site for resources you might be able to use um, this is free if you're interested in having an account just email us you can find information about doing that under the request an account page Thank you again for watching this tutorial.